Have you ever pondered over the consequences of a borrower not repaying a debt? This situation, known as credit default, can drastically shake up the financial ecosystem. But what exactly is credit default and how does it affect the world of finance? Let's delve into the depths of this term and unfold its implications. Imagine lending a substantial sum to a friend. You've agreed on the terms of repayment and you're confident your friend will uphold their end of the bargain. But then, time passes and your friend fails to pay back the agreed upon amount. This, in essence, is what we call credit default. It's a situation where a borrower, be it an individual, a company, or even a government, is unable to meet the legal obligation of debt repayment. Now, let's think about this on a larger scale. In the world of finance, lenders often mitigate the risk of credit default by charging interest on the borrowed money. This interest is essentially the cost of borrowing, and it helps cushion the blow if a borrower defaults. However, when a default does occur, it can trigger a domino effect that impacts not just the lender, but the entire financial system. One significant implication of credit default is its effect on credit ratings. These ratings are like a borrower's financial report card, and a default can lead to a significant downgrade. This downgrade can make it more difficult and expensive for the borrower to secure loans in the future. Another repercussion of credit default is the potential loss for investors. Many investors put their money into debt securities like bonds, which are essentially loans that can be bought and sold. If the issuer of these securities defaults, investors could lose a significant portion, if not all, of their investment. Now, you might be wondering, what happens to the defaulted debt? Well, in many cases, it's sold off to collection agencies for a fraction of its original value. This process, known as debt buying, allows lenders to recoup some of their losses. However, it also means the borrower now owes money to a new entity, often at higher interest rates. In conclusion, credit default is a complex phenomenon with wide-ranging implications. It's a situation where a borrower fails to repay a debt, leading to potential downgrades in credit ratings, potential losses for investors, and the selling off of defaulted debt. It's a stark reminder of the importance of responsible borrowing and the interconnectedness of our financial system. So, the next time you hear the term credit default, remember it's not just about a borrower failing to repay a debt. It's about the ripple effects that can shake up the financial landscape, affecting lenders, investors, and the broader economy. It's a term that underscores the importance of financial responsibility and the profound impacts of our monetary actions.